DNR American Bullies here. I want to thank all everybody for subscribing, um, liking, commenting our videos. We really appreciate it. Um, I told y'all I was going to keep y'all posted on the Rocky and Nairobi litter and Carlita and um, Onyx litter. Man, I've been through it all, man. I'm going to talk to y'all for a minute. <clears throat> I really do appreciate you guys liking, commenting, and subscribing our page. We really appreciate it. Even the new subscribers, we appreciate it. Um, I took, now something told me to take, okay, I took Carlita to the vet last week. They did a pregnancy test on Carlita. They said she did not take. So I was like, okay, she did not take. So I already had an appointment yesterday to take Nairobi to the um to get a um um uh hold on I'm going blank ultrasound ultrasound I took Nairobi she already had an appointment yesterday but something told me to take Carlita with me so I brought Carlita with me everybody probably went through this but this is my first time going through it so I thought I'd share it with y'all and some of these vets just don't know what they're talking about so I took Carlita with me um, and they said um, last week, they said Carlita didn't take, they gave her a blood test. They did the blood work for the um, pregnancy test for Carlita and it came back negative. She didn't take. So I took Carlita with Nairobi yesterday to see if she took. I wanted to do a double check. You know what I mean? Everybody, if you feel like you need to double check something, double check it. Um, so I brought Carlita with us yesterday. I was like, he was like, who do you want to put on the table first? I said, man, just go ahead and put Carlita on there because I got a pregnancy test last week. This is what I told the doctors, word for word. Go ahead, throw Carlita up there on the table, see if she took. I got a pregnancy test yesterday, I mean last week from her. The other vet saying that she didn't take. He was like, Dion, I'm going to tell you this now cool guy i'm gonna keep going to this vet he said dion the pregnancy tests do not work i said they do not work but they work for me on um honey because that's what i got honey pregnancy tests at he was like if you ask me they do not work so all right so i put her i picked her up put her on the table man that dude went um put that that jelly on there, he rubbed that belly. Carlita is confirmed, y'all. She's pregnant. Had a brother thinking like, all that hard work, but it's part of the game though. You know what I mean? It's part of breathing. So yeah, Carlita got some babies in her stomach, but the bad thing is, the bad news, Nairobi didn't take. Nairobi didn't take, y'all. So, I will be having some puppies from Onyx and Carlita. And that's about to be fire. So, if anybody interests, um, you can hit me up on here. Or you can shoot me a message. You can hit me up on Facebook, Dion Barber. You can shoot me a message. My number is 585-851-9507. And yes... She is due November 23rd, he said. But I'm thinking about letting her try it herself. And then if um, if that don't work, we're going to do a schedule. Um, he said he'll just um, do a C-section for me. Because this is her first litter. Come here, girl. Carlita. This is her first litter. And um, I want to make sure everything is smooth and great with her. I don't want her to be so too stressful. Because these are my babies right here. So... Excuse me. So I'm trying to make it good. I want to thank everybody that been following me. Even been commenting, positive. Even the negative. Even the thumbs down. You know what I mean? That's still motivating me. You know? Thumbs down. It might be still something you like. You know? So I just wanted to put that out there. I just wanted to do this video. So now I'm going to do a video for y'all of my girl Carlita. Y'all ready? Y'all sure? All right, let's do it. American Bullies, here's my girl, 
Carlita, she's starting to get big. And y'all ready to see how uh, many puppies she got in her, man? That man put that thing on her, rub that belly. She is 39 days. She's due November 23rd, y'all. So if anybody interests, please hit me up. Um, The number of puppies, he told me. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I don't know why I'm getting so many big litters. She got 10 plus in there, y'all. So my girl, she got so many babies, my girl probably got some small ones in there. And everybody was going crazy. Everybody was going crazy at the vet. Huh, mama? Huh, mama? Everybody going crazy. I'm uh, recording with my phone because my camera died. I got my girl Nairobi. She's going through her um, false pregnancy. Um, I got some bad news for her too. Um, cause, um, I don't know if some of you guys was watching my other videos or not, but, um, these kennels are coming down and, um, I'm going to be rehoming Nairobi. It's not because she didn't take y'all. So don't think of that. Um, I already had stuff go, um, moving and thinking of what I'm going to do. So, um, I'm going to replace Nairobi, rehomer, I mean. So, um, I'm going to get her fits first before I rehomer. Because I don't want to just throw her out there and people just keep using her, you know what I mean? So, she started a, the DNR out real good. And then, um, when the puppies get here, I'm going to decide how many I want to keep and stuff like that. She's so thick, y'all. That's Carlita, y'all. So if y'all interested, please hit me up. We got rocks. And I, I got a surprise for y'all in a couple more months. <laughs> Don't forget. I ain't forget about that. I still got a surprise for y'all. So uh, DNR, I want to thank y'all for following us from day one. And... A lot more to come. Yeah, y'all hear that excitedness in my voice? Yes, indeed. Boy came straight home from work to do this video for y'all because this is what DNR do. We keep our word, you know? That's all we have is your word. I see a couple new, um, new subscribers that followed us on our page just the last in the last past two weeks oh last past week we see that we got a couple new subscribers i appreciate y'all subscribing to our page and i will be um because i seen um just got them so i will be um subscribing back to you guys because that's what i do y'all show me love i show y'all love i will be subscribing back to you guys following what you guys have and got going on over there and um we're gonna push i salute to everybody that's breeding that's not breeding just on here to look at the american bullies i appreciate it and um i salute to y'all my girl nairobi man i thought she would have took with rocky that was a natural breeder i did three ais on her so, hey, I'm not mad because maybe two litters probably would have been too much for me. I'm not mad. But, hey, it is what it is. This is what everybody been wanting right here anyways because I've been getting my phone blown up for that. So, here she is, pregnant girl. She sleep right at the foot of my bed. They living their best life, y'all. It's time for them to eat run but i let her be by herself when she run because rocky get carried away and sometimes nairobi be getting carried away and um so i just let her do what she got to do because they got all this they can run in so yeah i appreciate y'all i didn't want to make it too long of a video because sometimes people they don't want to see hear nobody talk they want to see the dogs so, 
I'm gonna add a few pictures on here of um at the end of the video I'm gonna add a couple pictures and um a couple pictures of um onyx. Look at it y'all. Don't show me your back. I'm trying to let everybody see you, girl. For being stingy. Let them see you. Yeah. Ain't no telling what we're gonna get out of this, y'all. Her stomach her stomach. Stomach. Her stomach is um starting to pop. Do a little bubble. So, oh yeah. Hey, hey, don't even think about it. You'll go for a ride later. Um Oh yeah. Like I always do. I don't know if anybody else do it, but I know I do. I took two no three weeks off from work. <laughs> yes. I did it for Nairobi and I'm doing it for her. Any breeding that I do, and when they do, I take two to three weeks off. Because once the puppies pass that first week and a half, I know they're good. But anything allowed to happen, you know what I mean? But I like to be there that first full week because that's the crazy week. And if she gets a uh, C-section, she's going to be out of it a little. So I don't I like to keep everything good. I don't know where she's going. I like to keep everything good. Come back. Get back over here. Let's go. Let's go. She's hard headed, y'all. But she listen more better than Nairobi. But hey, y'all, it's like the smell and do they stuff too. But yeah, I'll catch y'all later. Y'all have a nice day. Peace. I'll take that one. There's three right there. Yep, I did a video.